Hey everybody, welcome back to uh, Sparrow's Nest Jeep Farm. I know, <laughs> I know, you haven't seen our faces too much. Uh, we're just, we're plugging away, we're burnt out, we're running on fumes, but we're still trying to go. So we have the east and the west walls are done. And now we're working on the south wall because we're going to have a utility north wall. Thank you. The north wall. We're working on the north wall because, as you can see, there's a corridor here that will be covered with a roof there. And down at the other end will be our utility room. And we have to have that section enclosed in order to get power out here so that we can get the water hooked up. Uh, we finally got some movement on our septic. Yay. Um, I don't know if you guys have seen, but we got spray foam. Let it adjust. There we go. We got spray foam in the garage, the fridge for the house. We got a really, really good deal on it. So we went ahead and purchased it early and now we're like, mm, that might not have been a best idea, but here we are. Anyway, so we've got the garage doors installed, the spray foam done. And then behind me here, you'll see that we're building the extended pantry. Um, it's gonna be in the far corner. There'll be a laundry set up back here. Um, I can't really get to it too well. There's stuff in the way. Hang on. There we go. Okay. So there's going to be a laundry set up here for while we're living out here in the garage. And above this and all the way across that edge for about eight feet or so on, is going to be a loft level. It will come out to here-ish. So that whole area will come out the full length um, from, there it is, here, out, and then from here, out, and there'll be a staircase against this wall. Um, and then there'll be a, a, like a gangplank walkway storage area up on top of the windows and doors um, just to give us some storage while we're out here and also for a uh, longer term storage later on. So anytime it's too windy, too wet, too whatever for working on siding, that's what we're working on now. But hopefully we can get a good amount of siding done in the coming weeks and get that closed in as much as possible so that we can get power out here and get moved. That is our huge goal right now is getting the power and the water hooked up and getting moved. Um, we need to get our house sold. So there's an update on that. The house is looking a little more closed in. So we've got about almost 16 feet done. We'll come to the doorway back here. And then there's a doorway here. And this is, I don't know if you can hear me. <laughs> this is the utility room area. So we have to get this section enclosed, which means getting this whole wall done and getting the roof done on this area here. There'll be a roof that comes out here and then getting the roof done up here on this side. Uh, we have to get all of that before we can do any of the utility hookups. So.
Anything to say? Anything for me to say? Yeah. Uh, slowly, but not quite so surely. <laughs> We're making this all up as we go. All right, guys, I will try and do quick little updates like this more often just because doing edited videos is just not happening right now. Uh, nobody has the time or mental capacity for that. <laughs> so we'll try and do this. Thanks for watching, guys.